You guys. So today. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> today we're doing lesson 11, lesson 12, okay? Uh, lesson 11 is kinds of sentences, and then lesson 12 is spelling lesson, okay? So that means for your homework, you guys can do the spelling quiz. Alright? Got it? Alright, so. Uh, I, we, actually, we have to go to page 239, because Kobe teacher is going to do the other pages, okay? So uh, sometimes we're going to like switch. I'll do later page, he'll do the earlier page, okay? So don't worry, don't be like, we didn't do these! We <laughs> will learn. Okay, we will learn. Alright, so 239, you guys open to 239. Kinds of sentences, okay? Very easy today. So there are four kinds of sentences, okay? Ooh, that's so cute. Oh, oh, oh. oh. did you touch it? <laughs> so there are four kinds of sentences. Don't forget statement. Okay. Statement, question, command, and excitement. Ooh. <laughs> Yeah, statement, right? Statement. It's just 
just say, oh, I saw you at school today. Nothing special, right? So what do we put at the end? Period. A period. Okay, question six, we put a period. Okay? Not a dot. <laughs> a period. A dot can be like this. Here's the sentence. You can just go dot. No. Period. Poke it up. Poke it up. I love it. Okay. Next one. Question seven. Where did you leave your coat? Question. Question. Yes. So what should we put at the end? The question seven is, where did you leave your coat? <laughs> That's really funny. Where did you leave your coat? The mom, mom is uh, angry. Then, then it would be like, like. Uh, yeah, if your mom was angry, she wouldn't say, "Where did you leave your coat?" She'd be like, "Why did you leave your coat?" You know. <laughs> uh, question nine. Look out. What kind of sentence? Excitement. Mm, not excitement. Kind of more Thanks. command. Command. Okay. Because it's saying like, "Watch out." Look out means like watch out, like move, something like that. Okay, so it's more like command. So what should we put at the end? Excla, exclamation point. Make sure you know how to say that. Question mark, period, exclamation point. Exclamation point. Okay. Exclamation point. So let's try this one with question mark. Look out. <laughs> If there's a car coming, you should say, look out, like that. Just go like that. Look out. Look out. Look out. It's like, no. That's serious situation, right? Go uh, Eleven, we had a good time at church. Okay. Yeah, it could, you know, I think it can be excitement or a statement. Because you could just say, we had a good time at church, right? Or just say, what? We had a good time at church. We could say like that. So both is okay for this one, okay? But I would choose statement. I think statement is better for this, okay? But if you do exclamation, you go, this is not, it should be exclamation, not excitement, right? You guys, it should be exclamation, not excitement. So I'm going to highlight that. Because that's wrong. All right, question 13. Tom goes to our Sunday school. Uh, statement, yeah, just statement. <laughs> statement, yeah. So what should we end it with? Yeah. <laughs> polka dot. With a bunch of polka dots. <laughs> uh, question 15. Who is pastor of your church? Question, yes. Question with question mark. Oh. Who is the pastor of your church? <laughs> 17, what a surprise we had. I think excitement, but should be exclamation, right? That word. Excitement or exclamation. Okay. Um, what else? Let's see. Next one, uh, which one do we have? Oh, yeah. 19, when did you become a Christian? Question, good. So add a question mark, okay? Question 21, write four sentences. Ooh, this is easy. So number one, the statement, two, question, command, and exclamation. I want everyone to write it. You guys... Do it by yourself, and then I'm going to go around and ask. Okay, mm -hmm. Not all of them, I'm just going to ask some, okay? So write four kinds of sentences, and then I'll ask you. You can do anything.
You don't know this one? Yeah. Uh, okay. Do you understand each meaning? Like these? Do you understand those? Yeah. Just thinking about sentence. Yeah. Thursday. Exclamation is a little bit hard, but you can just do something like, wow! We were surprised! Happy birthday! That's exclamation. Did you know that? You don't just say, happy birthday. You should say, happy birthday! Exclamation. Tell her, don't hit. She's fighting with you? Most 
superlative means most degree, so the brightest one. Next one, faster. Faster. We know that. Fastest. Fastest. Uh, next one, Galilee. Galilee. A region of northern Israel. So that's like, you know the country Israel. Northern Israel we say like Galilee, the old time, in the old time. Next one, healthful. Healthful. Do, helping to produce good health. Actually, nowadays we say like more, more times healthy, but something can be healthful. It helps you get healthy, okay? Next one, healthy. Healthy. Having good health. If you have good health, you're healthy. Next one, healthier. Healthier. More healthy. <laughs> Next one, healthiest. <laughs> the most healthy. Oh my God, so many ESCs. Next one, highest. Highest. Oh my God, there's so many. The highest, most high, right? Next one, larger. Larger. Largest. Largest. We don't need to talk about that. Next one, multitude. Multitude. A uh, great number of persons gathered together. Yeah, it, they, actually, I don't think it has to be just people. It can be things. Multitude means there's a lot of something, okay, in one place. Got it? So there's a multitude of people in that room. with many, okay? Next one, Nazareth. Nazareth. Childhood home of Jesus, located in the northern section of Lewin. Uh, another city in Israel. Another city. Okay. Next one. Prayerful. Prayerful. Uh, given to frequent. Frequent. That's important. Frequent prayer. So not many. It's just frequent. Many times. Okay. Next one. Quicker. Quicker. Meaning fast, right? Faster. And last one. Quickest. Quickest. And most quick. Wow. This is like so many E R E S T words, right? All right. So. For your homework, you're going to do the quiz. Let me see this for a second. You know what? If you want, you can just skip this page. 243, okay? Ooh. You don't have to do that. Uh... Your mouth is like a... 